I want our offense to be fast. I want it to be disciplined. I want it to be physical. I mean, that's that's kind of where we're going to start. You know, we want to play fast, and that doesn't necessarily mean snap the ball as many times as we can. I just mean I want our guys to move around, to get lined up fast, to play fast. Uh, you know, be disciplined. We 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 can't shoot ourselves in the foot in, in the foot with penalties and and lost yardage plays, and that comes with discipline. You know, understanding what penalties are. I want to do a great job of teaching that every day in practice, so they. And learn from that. I know Coach Brown, I've already noticed he does that himself, makes his own notes, and will tell you the staff meet the next day what your penalties were, and uh, that's, that's, that's something that we need to emphasize. Uh, I have no idea what, what their penalties were here last year. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying from my standpoint, we're going to focus on that. And then, you know, I want our team to be physical. I want our guys at every position, and that's the old line. That's out on the perimeter blocking. That's our running backs running physical. Uh, a physical mentality even with our quarterback. Now, I do want him to not take shots, okay? I don't want him to try to run people over or anything like that when he can, but, you know, at the same time, uh, Drake's a really competitive guy, and when the game's on the line, I've seen him make plays, but, you know, that's, that's, those are three things that we're going to really focus on. You know, I want to make sure that we, we really uh, establish that in the spring. Yeah, in more details, they're like, you know, do you draw on air raid philosophies? Is it more the Gus Nuzzle on spread concepts? Any more detail on kind of like, you know, what like, type of offense like to run? Yeah, we're going to build uh, North Carolina's offense. And, right. and those are things that from all over, I've worked for some really good coaches and, and done a lot of different things. I started as a true, quote, air raid guy way back in high school, but. You know, over the years, and different guys I've worked for, Todd Munkin and, and Gus Malzahn and, and different things, you know, learned a lot from those guys. You know, Todd Munkin had a pro background, NFL background, went to Oklahoma State in, in the air raid and, and then came to Southern Miss and I learned a ton from him. And then Coach Malzahn obviously uh, being able to run the football and be downhill a little more. I think those are things that will, you know, take the best of all those experiences I've had and even my own and, and, and build our offense here in North Carolina. Max said that you and Randy each brought each other up in the interview, y'all. What, what is your relationship with Randy? And had you, you worked with him before, yep. or was that someone that you always just No, know? just been friends with him for a long time and, and really respected uh, his teams and how they played and how they ran the football and how physical they were. We met a long time ago and got to hang out together and really just always kind of had that, that, that dream of working together and uh, stayed in touch. And, did a lot of clinics with each other in the off season, just trying to you know get bounce ideas off each other, and and uh, now it's all coming to fruition here, and that's something I'm really excited about working on. Him. Chip, along those lines, yep. you're saying fast, disciplined, physical. Mac was saying that Randy may have like run the damn ball on some shirts or hats or whatever. That's the rumor. I wasn't there for that interview, but yeah, he uh, definitely. That's uh, I know that's his mo for sure. Okay, well, so would, would fast, discipline, and physical pair nicely? I guess with that. Run the run no, the damn ball I mentality. Like, I, I do. I think no. I, yes, it does definitely. We want to be able to do that. You know, when you can run the football when you want to, I think it makes life easier for your quarterback, for your for your running backs, for your wideouts. It creates more one-on-one -on -one opportunities, and you know, I think that's the key. And playing good football is still the same thing it's always been. You know, you want to make sure that you create explosive plays, right? Limit negative plays, which are penalties, turnovers, and lost yardage plays, and. Be really good on third down. If you're 50 percent on third down. You might lead the country, and uh, that's something that we got to make sure. We're the, and then I think that at the end of the day, the teams that do those things the most are the ones you see at the top every year in, in offense and be our same goal here.